So, we're here with Richard, my good friend. We've known each other a few years now. That's right. We've yeah. seen each other, what, two or three times this year? Yeah, two or three, yeah. Um, Yorkshire Wartime. Yorkshire Wartime, that was just yeah. so hot, wasn't it? Yeah, Elvington so, and uh, Eden Camp, I believe. Yeah. Been a busy year. Yeah, that's been, been a busy year. So, what, um, what are you reenacting here today? So, today we are uh, American Second Armoured Division, uh, Normandy campaign. So, we've just literally uh, landed in Normandy, Normandy D-Day plus 10, um, pulled up into a recce location and that's what we're waiting now. We're spotting for the tanks to make sure that we can get um, good uh, good ground on the enemy activity. So how long have you been reenacting for? Reenacting for about five years now. You thoroughly enjoy it. I yeah, know you've, this it, Jeep yeah. is new to you. Yeah, the Jeep, I've had the Jeep about three months. Uh, it's been around uh, a couple of events already. Before that I had my Ural, which was um, Really enjoyable motorcycle and sidecar, painted in American colours, which turned a lot of heads. Um, really enjoyed that, but took a step. Have you up. still got that, or no, no? So, so yeah. you quite a few motorcycles at Yorkshire Wartime. Yeah, yeah. We've got. I've sold the uh, I've sold the Euro now to fund the Jeep. Um, I've got my I've got Liberty, which is what my Jeep's called. Um, and yeah, she's uh, she's very enjoyable. Is that my 50 cal? On yeah, there? 50 cal machine gun, which uh, which is fully ro uh, fully rotational uh, 360. Uh, on the uh, on the centre mount, I've also got a 30 calibre as well, which I ain't got here today. But um, 50 cal's a yeah, it's a beast. It can be fitted for gas or airsoft. Um, you can have it converted, so it's yeah, yeah. firing. Absolutely, yeah, we'll be doing that next year. Something to do with the winter winter yeah, project. Yeah. Isn't I've it? got I've got a simulated fire at the moment, which is on a, a Bluetooth speaker, which is here. So I thought it out. <laughs> which is here, which will do a simulated fire. So actually, while we're while we're here. I'll well try it out for you. What I do is, is I put that in my ammo tin, just like that. And then I use my modern uh, device, which I'm not allowed to really do. However, what I do is, is I set it up and then I will have some automatic fire. I can imagine that turns the head. Just like this. With the echo in the box as well, yep. it makes it sound so quite, now, quite good. So now, there's a 50 calibre machine gun firing, so when we do have members of the public walking around, they can turn heads and look at what we've got. That's great. And the winter project yeah. will really keep it going next year when you actually got Yeah, so when it's fitted for gas, when, when we do some battles, when it's fitted for gas, you'll be able to see it in its, in its all its glory. There'll be, there'll be um, uh, muscle velocity coming out of the front of it and, and everything. Um, so yeah, it's just a little project. I've also gone a step further in my weaponry as well. I've now got a blank firing Thompson machine gun, which is mounted on the front of the Jeep there. Um, again, when we do battles, we'll be firing that. I've also got the Colt 1911, which is also a blank firer. Yeah, okay. So I'm moving up in my in my world. So it it's very expensive. It just takes time because yeah, things yeah. don't come up all the time. No. Nope. You've got to be in the right place at the right time sometimes to Absolutely, get the yeah. equipment. You can. Getting quite sought after. Yeah, yeah. Bit. Yeah, since COVID uh, has come along, there's been a lot of different... Um, different prices a lot of people have, have took liberties on that should we say but also there's some people who are, who are leaving the reenactment scene what are looking to offload kit so you can fall upon decent stuff um but it's all about patience once you once you start getting into it you're bitten by the bug you'll keep moving forward with it and um, that's exactly what i'm doing you know just so this is coming time. towards the end of the season now it's we're into yeah. middle of september yeah. planning for next year lots more events yeah absolutely yeah so we've got the victory show uh, which we're looking at which will be uh, which just happened last week which you we went to um the we're looking at yorkshire, war, yorkshire war time uh, there'll be elvington which is the ref scene which is a, there's a big ref scene there uh, with the, uh, the, the the halifax bomber which yeah. actually bring out the hangar it's fantastic Full of RAF people, all all World War Two Battle of Britain. I might have to put that in my diary. I've looked at also yeah, got seven, Operation Ashbourne seven, again seven next yeah. year. Again, Operation Ashbourne, massive event, really, really good. I believe that's on the same weekend, but again, it's, it's bigger and better again. It's a bigger, a bigger, more important thing. There's Whitby as well again. Um, yeah, Whitby War Through the Ages. And these these things, what we've got here today, which is a multi -histor historical thing. We've got First World War, Second World War. We've got guys from the Napoleonic times. We've got guys from Romans. You know, there's quite a lot of different things in there. They're, they're really good. Yeah, I was chatting to some happen. chap over there who's pre-South Africa war, before the war. That's, yeah, that's right. Yeah, the guys over there, the red tunics and that. Yeah. So it's, it's really great, really great yeah. events. And it, and it is really good. It's, it's a good thing for the public to see. You know, people watching this video. You know, it's a good event to, to come along to and have a look at, um, learn something while you're here, and also you know, taking the ambience of what you can see. That's fantastic. So you have a good. 
the rest of the weekend. I'll yeah, be yeah. Catching up with you at another show. Yeah, yeah. Sometime soon. Absolutely. Thanks very much. Thank you, mate. Cheers. Brilliant. Thank you. All right. We'll cut there. Sometimes I'll go, oh, we'll, we're going now, we're done. I'll, I'll be going. I need to cut the video and I'm actually walking towards it and I'm finished talking. <laughs> it's good, mate. That's good, that. Interview.